When you share a file using ShareFile, it seamlessly adds an extra layer of security, ensuring that users can access it only after logging in. To start, you should create a user profile for your clients ahead of time. This ensures that they have their login credentials set up before they need to collaborate with you. There are three ways in which client accounts can be created. The first way is to create a new client. Go to People, Browse Clients, add your client here, and make sure to send the client an account activation email. They'll be able to activate their account and set up their password with this email. The second option is if a client user previously viewed a document via the method of entering their name and email when accessing the link. They will be recorded in ShareFile as a client, however, do not have an official account. You'll still need to finish setting up the account for this client. You can do this by going to People, Browse Clients, search for the client's name or email address, and select the client. Fill in all the necessary fields and save the changes. And on the right-hand side, click on Email Login Information. Lastly, select Notify to send their welcome email. The third option is adding a new user directly to a folder. Adding a user to a folder will prompt the user to fill out the fields necessary to create a client user. This adds a client immediately to a folder and sends the welcome email. Start by going to the folder you want to share, select People, and then add people to a folder. Create a new user and enter in their email address, first name, last name, and if applicable, their company and select Add. Set their folder permissions. And remember to make sure the Notify Added Users box is checked, otherwise a client will not receive an email to activate their client user account. Lastly, click on Add to complete the process. In addition to the previous share options, you can also email recipients directly from ShareFile. They'll be asked to log in using the email address the link was sent to, and only this person can view the file. This is ideal for sharing one-off files. If you have many files to share, we recommend adding the recipient to the folder within ShareFile. You can view your history of sent files in your ShareFile inbox.